What is good, ladies and gentlemen? This is your boy, Big Sin, coming back at you once again with another Sinful Black Reacts video. We hope you enjoyed Gooba. We hope you enjoyed Godzilla. Right now, we get into an artist I know nothing about. This is one of Hollywood's picks. What's up, Hollywood? What is good? What is good? This is your boy, James, a.k.a. Hollywood J. Black Live in the building once again. And yes... This is one of my uh, choices. I was scrolling through YouTube, checking out, you know, what's hot in hip hop. Just scrolling through, scrolling through, scrolling through. Top five hip hop videos on YouTube. This one stuck out to me. Uh, I saw a brother wearing Joker face paint, and I listened to the first 30 seconds of this song, and I was completely sold on it. So I was like, Big Sin, you got to see this fucking video. We got to we got to react to it together. I haven't watched it past thirty seconds. I just want to inform everybody that I I didn't cheat. Okay, I didn't watch it past thirty seconds. So we're gonna react to the the song. I haven't even heard the song. So we're gonna react to the the, the video as a whole, the song, the lyrics, and the visuals. So this is gonna be one of those kind of like Gooba, but I think it's gonna be based off of what I've seen in the first thirty seconds. I think this is gonna be pretty awesome. Well, like you said, like you said on the Godzilla reaction, Google was basically a Skittles commercial. So, <laughs> all right. So, you ready to get this start started? Impress me, sir. All right. That is a true and interesting fact. Okay. Yeah, fuck Cyber Wars. Give me the beat in the mic. Give me the freedom to write. Give me the vision to see my demons and beat them at night. Give me the pen in the back. Smoking man, I'm sick. But I think you know that already. You call me evil, but how would you know it unless you live it already? You think you're better, right? Cause nobody's seen what you've done in the dark. But if I put your life in this light, you would crumble and fight to survive or die. But bitch, I fucking knew that already. Hold on, ho 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 ho. Told you. First 30 seconds. Can can we rewind back to that whisper to the whole whisper verse? Yes, hold on. Hold Can we go on, back to that real quick? I gotta I hear got that you. shit one more time. So, okay, so J as and a lot of you know, I am a juggalo. Um, James knows the Joker DC character is my favorite comic book character. Um, so I'm very interested in this right now. All right, go ahead and spin that one more time. All right, I got you. We're gonna run it back. Smoking man, I'm sick. But I think you know that already. You call me evil, but how would you know it unless you live it already? You think you're better, right? Cause nobody's seen what you've done in the dark. But if I put your life in this light, you would crumble and fight to survive or die. But bitch, I fucking knew that already. I ain't special. But I specialize in making you feel especially stupid for judging a human while you sit at home and the whole world can't watch what you're doing or follow and hate all your movements. I ain't complaining, but I know the people who do it are sicker than me and I'm sick enough to fight my losers. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I just need to bring up gun safety. Don't put your finger on the trigger unless you're going to shoot it. Yeah, pretty much. Of course. Of course. But, you know, the Joker never believed in that either. So, you know, I mean. I, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> So far, it started off like a house of fire, dude. It's so it, the the song. My understanding of the basis is about cyberbullying, right? That's kind of like and how people bully each other online. And when I heard the when I heard the lyrics, it reminded me of a couple of things. It reminded me of Tech Nine, and then it kind of reminded me of you and some of the true feelings that you had, you know, growing up between 1999 and 2006. You know what I'm saying? That that's that's the feeling that I got. I mean, we got to do a backstory video one of these days. We've done one before, but we got to do like a real, real backstory video to kind of understand where they're coming from. But I want to talk about that because it was like, like shit. Like I felt this before. Like you know what I'm saying? Like I really felt what he's saying, um, in more ways than one. So let's keep it going. Let's keep running it. 
think you know me cause you double tap on a picture I hate the fact that you judge me, it's driving me crazy So when it's too deep, I say fuck it and drown in some liquor I write these verses in blood, I got chapters for dates And my heart is a biblical scripture And I ain't a prophet, but I can predict that you'll never catch happiness Till you the picture, so please continue to laugh If I'm a clown, you a circus sack But now I rap it's in a surge's mask Cause I place every syllable in a deliverable fashion from first to last And cut back with the message that hit it in melody Making them think and ask If I was the one on the table pushing, giving birth to rap Maybe it Okay, all right. So, with the with subject he's talking about, so on people that use Twitter, of course, you already know that people come out with a picture. People say I have a comment, celebrities, or even just a regular person. They post a picture, and no majority of those pictures, you know, comments would be nice if they're close friends, family members, whatever, right? And then you always got some. Snaky, shaky side motherfucker that's either not a fan or not a friend or wants to be a smart ass, always got something to say on your on your picture. Um, and it just makes you feel some type of way. You know what I'm saying? Like, makes some people feel some type of way. Me, I check my haters immediately. You know what I'm saying? But for some people, and, and Big Sid, he has no haters because they know that Phil will actually show up to his fucking house. But anyway, that's neither <laughs> here nor there. But some people aren't blessed with that fact, and so that's what he's kind of addressing. So, well, your thoughts on the, on what we just heard, sir? Um, again, gun safety. <laughs> the Joker didn't believe in gun safety. I know, I know, I know it's a prop, but it still bugs me. You know what I'm saying? Yes, <laughs> I, after all the be, gun training you went through, I know that that'll be the last time I bring it up in this video. Um, so far, I get what he's saying. I feel what he's saying. It's true. You know, motherfuckers. Open up Instagram. All they want to do is fucking double tap on the bad bitches, the fake titty bitches, the fucking Insta thoughts. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But if somebody puts out a real legit photo of themselves, most people are like, "Oh, you ugly. Put on some makeup. Go do this. Go, man. Fuck you. You, yeah. you is you. You live your life. Mm -hmm. Nobody gives a fuck about your opinion. To be honest. With you. Exactly. 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 And here we are giving our opinion about these videos. Yes, but but I am in absolute awe and love of this. So let's just keep it going. Get it. Was me. Maybe you like all my music, but don't really actually love me. Maybe you just want a picture. Maybe you just want to see me because you need some money. Maybe you think I'm happy. Maybe you think in reality, like in my post, repairing a hole when it's actually shaking and cutting the soul right out of me. I think I'm sick. I feel a rush of emotion whenever I post up a pic. I got a problem. I'm in the studio rapping while this girl is sucking my dick. She cut a hole in my heart and I fill it with women who love me because they think I'm rich. And if I be honest, I just do that bitch and I care, but I really do not give a shit. So what's your excuse? What helps you sleep? You leave a negative comment not knowing what you sow, you will be. I just smile when you post, thinking you're hurting me. But you see, the way the brain works, you become what you speak. I need peace, but y'all can offer that. I held my ground, I didn't sell my soul. I said, fuck the fame, y'all can take that offer back. Fuck the shelf, you can't take me off the rack. All the fame is not worth the heart attack. You're insane, you're in pain. I can tell by what you're saying, but... <laughs> yes, I believe I believe it'll pause with that visual right there. So, so, that, so so most of that verse, you're absolutely right, was me from 1999 to 2007. Yeah, yeah, I told you, I told you. I like what I what I felt this. I felt like this was a mix between you and Tech Nine. This is like it's. It, I felt that if Tech Nine had channeled Big Sin, uh, Big Sin through this, this is what we would get. And this is kind of when we go back to like the social media shit. And, he, and you see in the video, he got so fed up. The nigga was so crazy, just took a hammer to the damn laptop. He said, oh, motherfucker, fuck you. <laughs> you know? Um, and just, like he said, with, the, with, with you know, just saying that he's fucking with bitches that only fuck with him because he's famous, but you can't really, don't know what that situation is like. You don't even know if the nigga's really fucking with the bitch or not. But see, that that's, it's all, that's the whole point of the, of the video. It's like, these people come online with these assumptions and the insinuations thinking that they know everything and they don't. But yeah, because a lot of people post a fake life online. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Unless you unless you know the person personally, you really don't know what the fuck they into. Exactly. I keep telling people that never judge anybody by their Facebook posts. If they're ha if they every shit looks happy, they could be dying inside. If somebody looks like they're dying inside, they just could be playing people. You know what I'm saying? Like, like it, it could be either way. Somebody think they got bitches when they really got none. Somebody might not post no bitches and they got all the bitches. Shit, I didn't know my boy uh, James Bullet uh, had a fucking uh, had a kid on the way until he posted. Hey, by the way, I had a kid on the way. No, but yeah, no, this nigga. No, did you see the post yet? My my father day thing the other day. Fucking yeah. Mac Money had the daughter on the way. Yeah, I didn't know that. 
Me neither. It's, people stay low key and don't say shit just because of how in, in social media works. That's why I post fucking memes all day and I post our content. That's all I fucking do. You know what I'm saying? And, and maybe the inspirational post with the kid thing that I tagged you in, but that's about it, man. I can't because I can't stand people when they get other people's business. But let's let's keep it rocking. Let's keep it rocking. My bad. I forgot you were fragile. I forgot someone who doesn't even know me told you I'm an asshole. I forgot that I'm a villain. I forgot that I've always spread positivity, but you think I did it. I forgot that hatred stems from people who hate their own existence. I forgot I'm better off alone. I forgot I care for everyone's happiness, but forget about my own. I forgot I spend every waking second on my phone. <laughs> Come join my circus. I'm recruiting. I'm taking everyone who passes judgment, bitch, that's including everyone who thinks it's so amusing to put me down while I'm pursuing the keyboard warriors that live online behind the screen. That's just an illusion. Come, 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 join my search. Wow. <laughs> oh. oh, my God. He went after the, he just went after the, just what we talked about. The people living fake online lives and the keyboard warriors. He just came, he came for him. He, he said, jo come join this circus. Fuck it. Keep on, keep going. Keep going. We're going to keep going. We're going to keep going. Forget you fucking bricks. I'll fuck you till you love me, then pay you to do some tricks. I'm the doctor, I need a bag of nails and bricks. To lay down on the floor, so if you fail to land a flip, you can feel what I felt when you tried to come sink my ship. Let me explain, you all help me financially gain. I spend my money on mental health books and read them just to control all my pain. I don't wear clothes, but fuck this chain, and just like you, this chain is fake. I wear it to distract you from the blatant sadness written on my fucking face. What'd you expect? Did you think I wasn't mute to what you were saying and didn't see all of the disrespect? Do you think I'm not human, have no feelings? Or maybe you think I'm fucking weak and now I'm pleading. Maybe you think I'm just too good and that I'm fucking cheating. Or maybe, just maybe, you're blind and the hate inside your heart clouds your eyes and your mind and your ears when I rhyme. Even though we all know I'm one of the best of all time. Maybe you're just a fucking bitch and I can Stop comparing me to people who are not in my league. Stop saying I don't believe in God just because you can't read. Stop making fake profiles so you can spam my feed. I'm not alone. I know there's millions out there just like me. Damn. Fuck. All right, so what caught me right there, dog? That that verse where he said, "I'll fuck you till you love me, then I'll pay you to make you do tricks." You wanna know what's funny about that? What? Remember, I said that to somebody in Monsters. Yes, I. <laughs> <laughs> he just invited big sit in the clown father. He just Oh my god. Man. 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 Listen. That here. shit that shit hit a different way. I like, I really enjoyed that shit. I told you. Like how many how many views this shit got? Hold on, let me see. We already at four million. Four 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 point one million. The man is not signed to a uh, a, ma a major label. We just we determined that he's not on any label. We don't we don't um, need people to be signed to major labels anymore. No, no, we don't. But you know how shit goes when something this hot in a, in a short amount of time. The video only dropped uh, May six, so that's twelve days ago, and I think it had hit four million well before that. Um, but. It was on top on YouTube. It's on top on YouTube for a reason, because it's a it's a message in in and of itself. It's a it's a triple message. It comes from where you know where the where the bullies and the cyber bullies persist, 
and the true feelings about it and how it makes people feel, whether you're a celebrity or a regular human or otherwise. It really was one of those things that says, this is what's going on. And maybe if I provide this visual, maybe you'll understand it. I don't know if I'll change your behavior, but shit, I got to fucking do something because this shit's fucking ridiculous. Yeah. You know? um, that was, that's a deep, it's a deep ass song. You you actually have to pay attention to it, listen to what it's saying to catch it all. Yeah. Um, especially especially the initial fifteen second whisper is the reason I wanted to hear it again. Yeah. Um. I'm I'm a good dude, pops. Homeboy, he murdered that shit. He really yeah. did. It. Yeah. It's it was amazing. Like I was really, I was touched. I when I like I said, it was the first time I seen it, and then when I heard it. I just like I said, with that first thirty seconds, I'm like, this is this is something. And then as we got through the song, and I'm just like, wow. And it's really hard for a whole song nowadays to keep your whole attention. It needs, you know what yeah. I'm saying? And but shit, man, it's a it's a it's a it's a, it's a beast of a song, and it's a message at the same time. Got to give credit where credit's due. You know what? I'm gonna give that a replay. It. Replay it. Replay it all day fucking long. Oh, trust me, there's going to be a lot of killers that come across our table. No, no. Right now, we, like I said, Wednesday we had Godzilla, Joker today. But mm -hmm. I got something special for Mr. Black on our next episode. Well, I can't wait. This is so, going to be fun. So with that being said, my name is Big Sin. That's Hollywood J. Black. We will catch you next time on Sinful Black Reacts. Deuces.